Hey, welcome back to Handy Andy's Home Improvement. Uh, it's been a little while, and this year I'm going to be trying out the Greenworks Pro 80 volt electric lawnmower, and I will be providing my feedback on that. So uh, like this video and subscribe if you would like to see more like this. I hope you enjoy, and I hope this is informative for you in deciding whether or not you cut the gas, go electric, and or uh, pursue other ways of cutting your grass. Hey, I just wanted to give a little update on the mower as I'm cutting the grass. Uh, so I did accidentally go over an adapter to my hose that I had let uh, sit by the garden over there and uh, the grass was long, I didn't see it. Went over that, mower shut off, and as a result of that, uh, the battery got overheated so I had to swap it out. Uh, for my second battery and then uh, from you know starting on that side of the yard doing all of this you know uh, uh, back half here and uh, then doing this back corner of the yard I was going let's see if I can do this without making you dizzy I was going by my compost bin which you can see right there and there happened to be a walnut that walnut got caught in the mower just like the uh, hose adapter did and the uh, the mower turned off. I was able to get it started back up with that same battery, uh, but just a minute later, uh, it died. I think as the battery uh, ran out of juice and or overheated. So I'm gonna try to swap this out with the other battery. Hopefully that one's cooled down, ready to go. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I got about 20 minutes on the first battery before hitting the hose adapter. Uh, and then I swapped that out for this one, probably about 20 minutes more before hitting the walnut. And so, yeah, I was expecting to get uh, uh, 90 minutes per battery, uh, but it could just be the time of day. It's the afternoon, a little hot. You can probably see I'm sweating. Or, uh, you know, it could just be uh, that the grass that I'm cutting is a little bit longer, a little bit wetter uh, than you would probably prefer. Uh, so, you know, I am getting reduced time on those batteries. Uh, but so far, the, the mower runs smoothly. I'm not having to go over grass multiple times, even if the grass is uh, one foot high in some areas. Uh, I'm not having to go over those spots twice. It's just that, you know, if I hit some debris, uh, that can be an issue. Uh, so, so far, I'm really happy with it. And, uh, you know, it, it runs super smooth, a great break for me from the real mower. I'm going to be able to get my entire yard cut over the course of about two hours probably. Uh, whereas before with the real mower, I'd do this over the course of multiple days taking breaks because it would make me tired. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to try to swap this out with the other battery, keep going, or I might just take a little break, drink some lemonade, uh, and then get back to it. Hey, okay. so I was able to cut all of the grass in under three hours using the Greenworks Pro 80 volt mower. And I did notice that the batteries only lasted about 20 minutes long, uh, which was kind of disappointing, but they were able to recharge uh, with enough time. I actually uh, trimmed uh, using the uh, grass trimmer uh, around uh, strawberry and raspberry plants that I have back there, uh, doing that while the batteries charged. So I didn't really lose much time. I was still able to uh, make progress with the lawn over the course of the less than three hours. Uh, so that was nice. Uh, but yeah, I was a little disappointed in that. It could just be that the grass is a little bit long. I've let it go for about a month uh, without cutting it. So if you stay on top of your grass every other weekend cutting it, uh, I think the green works uh, mower would work for you. Um, I did get it, see a lot of reviews on the 40 volt, uh, but the 80 volt one was on sale. And so that's why I went with it. And I should note that I do have uh, a fair amount of sticks uh, in the yard, kind of because of this tree. And I do have gravel around the front of the house. Uh, so I was a little skeptical to uh, run the mower around those areas. And so what I might do is I might actually get a uh, weed whacker, Greenworks 80 volt weed whacker, uh, that I would then be able to use these batteries for, and that I feel a little more comfortable uh, going around gravel, not, uh, not being concerned about uh, rocks flying everywhere. Um, so that is something that I might look into getting. Uh, but yeah, you could get this uh, Greenworks mower. Uh, for me, I got it for a little less than 400 bucks. I don't want to spend more than that on a mower. And from the reviews that I was looking at, Greenworks was the uh, most economical as far as uh, the functionality goes. So if you're considering getting into a uh, battery powered mower, Greenworks might be a good option because it is a little more economical. And you know, that's really what this is all about. You have to, uh, as far as 
goes, green energy goes, renewable energy goes. Uh, you don't start with progress. It takes time to make progress. And so with that, you know, you might spend $400 on a mower, on a battery powered mower, rather than 100 on a gas powered mower. Uh, but then you're also gonna be paying for that gas, paying for all that maintenance. We'll see if this uh, battery powered mower needs maintenance next year. Uh, from the reviews that I've seen, I don't think it will. Hopefully it doesn't. Um, but yeah, this, the, the money that goes into a battery powered mower is investing in renewable energy. And that's an important step. If you believe in a green future, if you believe in renewable energy, it takes, uh, you know, investment in that, uh, for it to become more economical and more affordable for more people. And for me and my uh, financial situation, I felt that it was a good investment. It may not be right for you. And, you know, don't worry if you, uh, feel that a gas powered mower is better for you, uh, then by all means you should do that. Uh, but I do think that it's important to consider that new technologies do cost more money initially, but then over time they become more affordable. And that's really how we build a green renewable future. Uh, so if you are interested in that, uh, check out the uh, uh, Greenworks mowers as well as other uh, battery powered mowers that might be great options for you. And again, thanks a lot for watching and uh, like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this on home improvement and thinking about you know a more renewable, more green future. Thanks a lot for watching. Take care.